So I have an idea here on invent and don't invent. And basically, it's water weights, faster transportation of your gym set. And all it is is like gallons of water, but like 10 pounds intervals. And that will give you the weight that you require that's required or that you require for your workout anyway what i wanted to discuss briefly was and you guys can look at this on invent or don't invent but what i wanted to discuss and kind of talk about was the um, periodic table. Here is some information about so periodic table. You had the periodic table and the elements in raw form, right? So you have the real element that was mined then you have the law of um The law of what is that word, man? I wish I had a secretary or something. I think it's I I forget it like it's like weight. Um, yeah, this is it. Like, um, picking up. A heavy object with a lever. It's, it's the law of something. Anyways, this is what I'm speaking of or re referencing to. Um, And I still can't find the word. Um, anyways, it's, 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 it has to be something with this. It's like, um, See, see all this stuff here? You see this? He's hurting. Anyways, what I was trying to get at was the raw iron like powder or element iron 
Um, Okay. Iron oh powder. Okay, this. So or like um rust. See because there's there's the rust. of the iron or that element basically is ionizing or something like that. It's ionizing or something like that and, and it creates this. So what I was thinking was will a iron as a whole like say you have a an object like say a round object like a marble then you allowed it to be rusted would it equal the same and if not will you be lifting the same amount in 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 a law like the law of gravity, but not really feeling the the actual gravity, it'll be less gravitational pull, but if it got ionized and if it once weighed say 10 pounds, but now it weighs five for whatever reason. If in theory, if it does go down in weight, then that would mean that bodybuilders, fitness trainers would be able to get stronger or more muscle build up as they concentrate that or as they work out, you know. And and that If if it proves true, then other tests can be performed to perfect, perfect or advance the way that we exercise at the gym. Right? So, if all this equals to, like I said, 10 pounds, and then you got it down to five, especially if you had a, like a test tube and you allowed it to get rusted inside of that tube where none of the iron can escape, you just allow it to get rusted. Would it still equal the same? And if it does, then you could cancel this out. But if it doesn't, if it goes down for whatever reason, then there, there were, then there is a law present there and that can be implemented like the law of gravity I mean like yeah like the law of gravity or the law of flight and and um, I 
and um, gravity and just just like when you when you, when you could lift the heavy um, lifting a heavy object According to my health, lifting a heavy object from water. According to Quora, for example, helium is lighter than air, so the weight of the displaced air is greater, so the balloon experiences an upward buoyant force. In the case of an object submerged in water, it's easier to lift because the weight of the displaced water is greater than if it were in air. See, so you have negative weight resistance. So, will someone get stronger if they lifted the same amount of weight as underwater? That could be another test that can be performed on an athlete or someone that aspires to become a bodybuilder or fitness model for easy and fast results and a fast physique formation I guess these theories will be remain a theory to me until proven otherwise. So anyways, I just um wanted to share this because when you have in a way I'm going to change the subject but you have iron and it could it, it, it could it could feel like say two of these um, spaces these two spaces right here right and then you have water and it could only fill one, but they could equal the same amount. So you have one area where it fills a lot of space and then less space. Maybe there's something else out there that could be reduced and whatever could be reduced, then you have the same amount of weight, but less space. So if you could find that whatever it might be, then in the future to have a better gym set with less clutter and crap, then you would have to find which element or whatever it might be to cut that and have the la less amount of elements or resources and condensing that to have something that won't be so cluttery right so anyway I guess like I said these these are just theories and they can be tested maybe I'm wrong but if I am and I guess someone can share their comments in the comment section and, you know, maybe edify me in this area. I'm not here to prove anyone wrong, anyone right. I just, these are things that just came to my mind and felt like sharing them. So, 
Thank you for watching this. Thank you for listening. Have a great day.